What do your kidneys do? You are going to be the most interesting person at the dinner party once you figure out what your kidneys do. I'm Dr. Paul Zalzo. And I'm Dr. Brad Weening. Welcome to Talking With Docs. Today we have a kidney doctor, a nephrologist, Dr. Sanjay Bentea. We've been trying to get this guy on our channel for like two years, but he's like snuffleupagus. We finally pinned him down. He's here this morning. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for having yeah, me. Yeah, please tell us. I mean, hey, I'm thinking of donating a kidney. Do I need it? What do the kidneys do? So the kidneys are like the main filtering units of the body. So they uh, regulate, you know, your whole c blood composition. So they clean uh, and remove any wastes or toxins that build up in your system. They also control your volume. So if you take too much volume in, they're going to eliminate that through your urine as well. They also can uh, control, let's say, the chemistry of your body. So control things like sodium and potassium. You need normal values for those to maintain cellular function. And they do other things that are involved in multiple aspects of the body, including uh, involving the endocrine system or the hematological system where you want to control, let's say, the level of your hemoglobin, which is the element of your bloodstream that delivers oxygen to all your tissues of your body. Kidneys, man, they do a lot. And the we have some things in common. There's two kidneys, just like all the stuff we deal with, there's two of. Yeah. Right? Why do we have two? Is there is that is everybody born with two or well I also think that with all the things that the kidneys do, like I say that they're like the the James Brown organ of your body. They're like oh. the hardest working man <laughs> in show show business, right? Okay, so okay. they do all these things and, and they're quite vital to uh, the functioning of various aspects, including bone health actually, Paul. So, okay, there you go. Yeah. There's a link. Yeah. They do play a role. And there's two of them. They live sort of in your flank and uh, in, uh, in your abdomen, I guess, at the back. They're retroperitoneal, outside the peritoneum, are they not? Yeah, yeah. So, and they, uh, they contain the main filtering units of the kidneys. So the main filtering units of the kidney are called nephrons. It comes from a Greek origin word, like all of our, what we use in our vernacular. Mm -hmm. And uh, so there's a million of these on each side, which is why, as a kidney specialist, we're nephrologists. So... Uh, that's what, uh, where we look after the medical side of kidney disease. So we look after chronic kidney disease, which means, let's say, lower kidney filtering function all the way down to end-stage kidney disease. We deal with transplantation, pre- and post-transplantation. The surgeons do their thing in terms of implanting the kidney. We deal with the chemical abnormalities that can occur, blood and protein that occur in the urine because of abnormalities in these filtering units. And we deal a lot with high blood pressure, which is uh, intricately involved with uh, kidney disease. And uh, on the side, some of us do stone prevention. Wow. Yeah, so this is in contrast to our urology colleagues who deal with all the anatomical stuff, right? They, right. De they deal with kidney cancers, stones that might obstruct your, the flow of urine, right. uh, enlarged prostates, anything along the urinary tract. Okay, and because so much of our bodies are made of water, uh, that's why kidneys play such a vital role because they are, in, they are in the business of filtering out the fluids in our body, helping us excrete and retain the stuff we need. Um, so what are some of the things that uh, can go wrong with kidneys? So, I mean, the biggest thing that I think people need to know is as you age, your kidney filtering function goes down. So just like, you know, I tell patients, uh, Compared to when you're 30, let's say you're 70, you don't run as fast, you don't lift as much, you might not run it, you might not uh, do the crossword puzzle as fast. So, what? you know, your kidney filtering function, you know, your kidneys are as old as you are. Um, when outside of that, in the normal aging decline in kidney function, you can have other disease entities that cause your kidney filtering to go down. And there's some things you can do about it in terms of preventing it uh, if you don't have it, and if you do have it, preventing any progression of kidney disease. Okay, so as we age, our filtration goes down, and things can happen to our kidneys, and we're going to address some of those in other videos. Absolutely. That's basically your kidneys. That's what your kidneys are. This is the kind of doctor that looks after your kidneys, and I think kidney health is important, and make sure that you are taking part in actively monitoring your kidneys with your healthcare provider. And I think that's the take home message is that people need to be aware of A, what their kidneys do, B, how they're affected by the lifestyle that you leave. We're gonna talk about that. And to see your doctor if you think you have a problem because some of these things are correctable and preventable. And that's gonna be the take home message in our, in our next video. So now you know, if you like this video, please like it, subscribe to our channel. And remember, you are in charge of your own health. We'll see you next time. Thank you very much, Dr. Pendey.